All right, welcome back, Cheap Pete's Garage. Today, I'm gonna to do a will it run on this 1963 International C120 four x four. I got this pickup in 1998. It used to belong to my great, great uncle. He had owned it since 1965. So, it's been in the family for a few years. It's got a 266 V8 in it. I haven't had it on the road since 2002, so what are we at, 22 years now? It hasn't been started in, I bet it's probably been three or four years since I've taken actually started it up. So I guess it's going to be kind of a question whether will it fire up today. Of course, I'm just going to bottle feed it. I'm not going to put anything in the gas tank because I don't need a bunch of gas sitting in there. It's going to take and go bad. You guys just kind of little walk around over here. Take the tour, if you will. Step side long box. Used to be a pretty good running pickup. Any more? I don't know. It had spent a lot of its life inside up until well, the last 24 years or so. Of course, you know, headliners. What's left of it's coming down. Crunchy. Which it's a shame it couldn't have been put inside, but I guess so it goes. Let's see if I can get past your door open. It was sitting so long that the hinges are pretty stiff. Seat cover's pretty bad. See, it's a 120. See, now this here is actually the 61, 62 style. But T International, when they sold their vehicles, that's the year they titled them. So if it was a carryover to say 1963, like this one is. This here would have been a 62, but it was sold in 63, so it was titled as a 63, which I think is kind of dumb, but apparently that's what they like. All they wanted to do it, they're getting some spots in the cowl there, getting some rust in them too. I haven't looked this thing over in a long time. Well, let's take and get into it and see what happens with it. Pull the air cleaner off it. I'll put some gas on the carb. Verify that it does crank over. So, let's see what happens. See if we can fill the bowl up. Oh yeah, I just looks all over the place. It's fine. Alright, well, hopefully this will be the first start in you know, three or four years. Go ahead and crank the key. Until she's dry. Again. 
go ahead. Again. Yes. Again. Well, as you guys see, it did take a start. It does run if you feed it. This pickup only has like 80,000 miles on it. I think what the odometer says on it. Which, you know, and years ago, that was probably quite a few miles, but today it's nothing like that. You can get 200,000 miles on a vehicle and it's still not that high in mileage. Well, at least she still runs anyway. Got a little oil up the top end, hopefully. Should take and get it put back on the road, what I should do. This thing was a rough riding old rig back in the day when I used to drive it. But it'd go through about anything. Four-wheel drive. Sat up high. And it had a hell of a heater in it. So, anyway, you guys like watching me play old derelict garbage like this or anything else that I've posted, might want to consider subscribing to the channel. Like, share, comment, what have you. Hope the wind noise wasn't too bad for you since we got a little wind today, but it's South Dakota, so it seems like the wind always blows. Well, I'm going to leave her to that, so thanks for watching. Till the next one, bye.